What's going on guys? Welcome back. Been a long time since I filmed a video. Just been busy with figuring out all this brand stuff out. Got a little surprise I'm going to show you here in a minute. And soon to be merchandise. I just came up with um, this shirt. I got the logo designed. And I love it. Looks really cool. But now I got these shirts in like a little army green. Super soft. They actually will be available this weekend when you guys are seeing this video. So head over to my Instagram, Bullets and Baits Co. to check these out. And um, also this 4th of July, I got some pretty cool stuff coming your guys' way. So stay tuned for that. Follow me on Instagram, TikTok, subscribe on here. And we're going to be doing something a little different. Another thing I forgot to say about the shirts. Um, we only have limited quantity. We probably have 15 shirts for sale right now. So make sure you go get them on my Instagram while they are available right away the day they drop. And second thing is when you order one of these shirts, you get a free pack of bait of your choice. So $25 plus shipping, pretty good deal. Make sure you go to my Instagram to check it out. So like I said today, we're going to be doing something a little different here. Um, we're going to be doing a my friends pick my lure color challenge. So pretty much ask my friends, a few of them on Snapchat, to send me three colors. The first color is going to be the colorant, and then the second color is going to be glitters, two glitters. And we're going to see what we can come up with. Um, I like this, just maybe come up with some new colors, do something a little different. Content's been pretty boring lately, so we're going to do this um, and see how it all turns out. I think it'll be pretty fun. I don't know why I'm talking, but let's start making these baits. Okay, so here are the colors they chose. Um, I'll pop up the screenshots on the screen right now, but we had to do a little makeshifting because I don't have every single color, but first color suggested was plum with teal and silver flake. So, don't have plum color, so we're going to try and make it with some red and purple. And then I don't have teal, but I have emerald green. And then we got some silver flake. Second is a whitish clear with blue and black flake. You got all those. Third one was a little confusing. I was trying to figure out what I could do to match the color. So we're going to do pink bubblegum colorant because I've never done that before. Blue flake and we're going to substitute with silver flake. So let's start making the first color. Okay, so we're going to make a plum color which I've never made plum, plum before, so we're going to attempt this. First we're just going to add a few drops of purple. See what that gets us. Really what plum is, is a dark purple. So this is a very bright purple. So, actually, let's try something else. This lid doesn't work, so we're going to attempt to pour in some. Ooh. It's more of like a June buggy color. Um, right now, I'm really just playing with it because I'm not selling these, so... Well, why not add a drop of black to darken up the purple? See what that does. I think plum is more red and I should have just gone with the red to begin with. But you know what? I can't change it now. So... Let's add our flake. So this is a one-fourth teaspoon. We're going to add about half of that. So we have a half a cup. And then a half a teaspoon of silver. Stir it up. Needs more flake. Come 
we're just going to load this color with flake. There we go. So I've got three molds here. And I'm trying to decide on what mold I want to fill with what. So I think for this I'm going to do ribbon tails. For the white I'm going to do crawls. No, for the white I'm going to do swim baits and for the crawls I'm going to do pink. Because I've never made pink crawls. And I use my Senko mold all the time. So let's shoot these. Okay. Ooh, that did not sound good. But we're going to let the air back out. This uh, bass tackle, this bass tackle mold is actually really easy to shoot. It shoots really well. So now we're going to be opening our first color. This was the plum with emerald and silver flake. Like I said, this mold usually shoots really well. Um, not really any problems. Take them out of the mold. And here is your purple with emerald flake. Next color is the white with black and blue flake. I've actually been really digging the white colored baits this springtime, especially the white with red. Uh, I haven't tried this one yet, so we're going to see how this turns out. Just going to add our white. And we're going to do about a fourth a teaspoon of each. I'm going to put a little more blue flake. Okay, sorry about that. Card was full. Don't know how much I filmed that, but we're going to mix this up. That looks killer. Filming a TikTok and filming a video and taking pictures for Instagram is extremely hard if you haven't tried it. We are just going to inject our second color. Okay, well that was messy, but we got it done. Let's see how those turn out. So we had a little bit extra, so I did a crawl mold, but let's open these up. Ooh, these look really good. White with black and blue flake. I like it. We are going to be doing the third and final color. This is bubble gum with blue and silver flake. I'm interested to see how this turns out. It's actually my first time using this colorant, by the way. And we're running out of camera battery, so I gotta do this quick. I'm gonna do a full scoop of silver this time. And uh, probably half scoop of blue. There we go. Sorry, I'm going super fast right now. I'm running out of camera battery. Just gonna make a few of these crawls. Well, these are our final colors. Let me know what you think. This is uh, plum with emerald green and silver flake. This is white with black and blue flake. And this is pink with blue and silver flake. 
If you want anything like this for yourself, DM me on Instagram or leave a comment. I'll somehow find a way to contact you. They're $5 a bag. Quantity depends on what you get. Just DM me, email me for questions, and I can make that happen for you. See you guys next time.